I mean, you know, tough first half against Clemson, but it seems like you guys were playing better. Second half, is there you know, anything you can take away from how you guys played the second half against Clemson? Um, really, I think that we just need to start faster on offense. The defense started out pretty fast. I felt like they played well, and they got, got us the ball back a couple times to start the game off. But offensively, I think just to start faster so that we're not going to be uh, having to play from behind so much. You know, another two touchdown catches for you. Just, just talk about you know, your play this year. What do you think has been the, the key to your sort of resurgence this year? Um, really, I think it was just the position that the coaches put me in. Uh, instead of playing fullback, now that I'm an H-back playing on the line tight end and in the slot and everything, I think that that's helped me out the most to me having the opportunity to get open and catch the ball a little bit more. You know, just looking ahead this week, BC, what do you see? What do they bring to the table? Um, BC is definitely a great defensive team. They always are. So I mean, they're no matter what, they're gonna they're gonna come out and have a great defense, and we've seen that on film already, where they're a, f a physical defense, and they're gonna bring up and they're gonna come on Saturday and be ready to play. You know, just a win. How bad does this team need a, need a win? Oh, uh, we we definitely need a win. We've had a couple losses now, and uh, to have a win on Saturday, that would be a big thing for us. Tommy, how important is it for you guys to not look at BC's record? knowing that this is probably the easiest team left on your schedule, but you still got to go in here and uh, perform at a high level? Um, honestly, I don't think we ever look at their schedule and say, oh, this team's terrible or anything like that. But we're going into that game and we're saying, BC is a good team because they are. They've had a couple bad breaks, but they're a good team and we need to play like that. And we need to go out and play our best game to get a win or else they can beat us. You speak about playing your best game. Um, obviously, every game from this point <laughs> forward is a must win. For you guys, but how important is it for you guys to put on a good performance uh, to give you some momentum, momentum down the stretch of the season? I think that would that's definitely something that we need to do. We need to play a great game uh, offensively, defensively, and on special teams to get us some momentum to be able to uh, become ball eligible. How different is it to have Mike Camp back in the um, lineup for you guys, and what does he do for your offense? Camp really just brings versatility to our offense. He can do so many things, so that helps us out so much because we can run a simple bubble and he can get us 30, 40 yards. So just having him back there and being able to make plays helps us out on many different levels. You said BC's defense has always been good or whatnot. Well, what is it about uh, Boston College's defense that you know gives gives people trouble? They. They're very disciplined. They're a very disciplined team. They they run a lot of zone coverages and things like that. And when they don't really miss assignments, they're like I said, very disciplined. And they uh, run to the ball. They're always fast and physical, and they're always big. So and they have a great defensive line always. So that's that's usually how BC's defenses are made up. That they're just uh, great defensive teams.